guys what is up welcome back to Alfio's gaming channel this is Maya as always and we are back in Mesozoica um we're gonna be starting off where we left off last time and that would be with our cute cuddly little packy buddies and their neighbors the Cocaridontosaurus I uh, don't know if I said that right but we're gonna hope that I did and if I didn't please do correct me in the comments but uh wow this dude's still laying down but again i want to apologize for my very weird upload schedule i've had recently um so cute and ugly at the same time We're going to try to do as much recording today as we can to make up for all the lack of recording that I've been doing. Um, hopefully you guys can forgive me though, but I think I got my sleep schedule fixed back up. So I'm going to try and keep up with it this time and stop fucking staying up until 4am just because, you know, friends wanted to play. I'm sorry guys, I love you, you know I do, but... I need sleep is bad. <laughs> Anyways, guys, let's uh let's get to this. I want to go and see which dino we're gonna get this time. Um I was thinking about one of the other newer ones that came out. But I really like the Packy Rhino too. Packy Rhino is love. It's so chunky and adorable. It needs, it needs the attention, you know? Um, oh, also, while we're looking through these, um, I'm going to try and do a video or two from Hunter called The Wild with Raven and Mark. And we're going to go bison hunting. Last time we did that, me and Mark annihilated a herd of apparently 60 plus. It wasn't actually one herd. We pretty much annihilated the entire fucking population of bison. It was crazy, but it was really cool at the same time. Um, I made quite a bit of money on that too. Oh, we got the albino. We got the albino packy rhino. He's so cute. Bark. Bark, bark. Bark, bark, bark. Leaf cutter. Sorry if this is really loud, guys. Ooh, I love the razor wind. It's so pretty. You guys will get a better look at these later, by the way. Gravel. Ooh, the oka is pretty. Pretty! I actually really like the parasaur in this, too. They have some really pretty designs. Holly. Blue jeans. I kind of want to do like a really big pen for these guys. Boulder. Try to, um, try to get like a really big uh, collection, like one of each skin. It'd be cool. Looks like a gazelle. That's a legendary skin. Really? Okay.
I really feel like some of these should not be legendary skins. It's like the way they did it, the more natural the skin looks, the better grade it is. But like there's some skins that are like poor quality and they're so pretty. Like that one. That's a poor quality skin, but it's so pretty. I don't want no Albertos. Okay, I think we've got enough skins now. So we're gonna we're gonna go and we're gonna make some exhibits. You. Yeah. Uh, let's see. Let's see. I kind of wanna like keep this area unmade, but. What if... Let's try this. I think that's... yeah. This should be good. Ew. Yeah. That should work. Just get rid of that a little bit. There we go. These water troughs, these prefab ones are so expensive. I know I usually make them myself, but I'm doing this to save time.
Okay. We are now going to hatch us in some... Pachyvanos! Cause you're so cute! Okay, we gotta get an albino in because y'all know I love my albinos. Get an oka. Leaf cutter. Bongo. Vaser wind. Holly. Okay, we got we gotta wait, guys. Sorry. Okay, so we'll start on Holly after. Do a quick game save. And go back on about a business. These guys are really cute, in my opinion. Look at it all. Gimme. They're stumpy and whatnot, but they're still really cute. <laughs> Sorry. The the awkward little chuckle. It's cute though. <laughs> oh, oh, I see our Oka brethren. Come over here, brother or sister. I don't know if it's a brother or sister. Come back y'all. I am short and stumpy. It is very difficult to catch up with you. <laughs> I tried to yell at it, but it didn't help much. Come on. How is he so much bigger than the albino? Is it because we were controlling the albino? That's probably it. It's bigger because we were controlling the albino, so the albino wasn't aging. I'm sorry. I made you a midget. You are now the, the, the dwarf of the group. I guess that's fitting, though, since you're an albino. I'll just control the Oka until you catch up. Okay, guys. We got all the foliage down. Or at least most of it. I realize that it's not beautiful or anything like that. But it looks pretty good. And I think we're also ready for the next set of little ones. There we go. Alright. Well, they're coming out. We're gonna save the game again. Because with these super, super early access type games, it's always a very good idea to keep them freshly saved. That way you don't lose anything. Gimme, gimme. We're gonna look at all the ones that we've got so far. Oh, look at those patterns on the face. It looks gorgeous. And those random green stripeds. It's okay. It's very pretty, though. They're not very fast. But that's okay. Next, we'll go and have a look at the leaf cutter. This actually looks pretty nice. I wasn't too sure how this would look, but... It looks quite nice. 
The pale green is very pretty. How is even this one bigger than the albino? The fuck? I'm wondering if maybe they implemented something to where the albinos grow slower, maybe? The albino was literally the first to come out. What the hell, dude? I don't get it. I don't get it. Oh well. Where are our others? I think this is our bongo. Oh, it looks so pretty. I love the colors. The choice in colors go really well together. It's quite beautiful. I think this may be my favorite one. It's almost like a, a burnt wood, you know? It's almost what it looks like is burnt wood. This is very orange. Very orange. I do not really like those kind of colors, you know. But it looks pretty good either way. This is the holly one. The red frill bleeding into green looks pretty good, actually. Kind of didn't expect it to. I think this is the bolder one. It looks pretty cute. <laughs> Nick, it's blushing. Bro, what are you trying to do to the albino? For shame. They're all just kind of laying around the hatchery. Like, we must, we must greet our new, our new babies when they come out. There's our blue jeans. What are you? I don't remember what you're called. This is one of our other ones, so. Go look at the blue genids. It really does look like blue jeans. Like faded glories or something. They're all just like laying around. Do you guys like to cuddle? Yeah, is that what's going on here? Do you like cuddling? I'm pretty sure that they're going to be implementing, like, actually letting them breed and whatnot. I can't say for certain though because I don't really know, but that would be really cool. I would totally, totally let them go crazy and just fucking cover this whole cage. Either way. Once they all grow big and strong, this cage will be very full. I'm pretty sure this dude over here is full grown. Pretty sure. Some of them grow faster than the others. That's really weird. Hmm. I wonder if that's a mechanic, actually. I really wish there was some other kind of fucking... 
like uh, info window for dinos. Make sure their age and if they're healthy and whatnot. Instead of just pressing space and seeing bubbles. They look really nice though. And they're great for pictures. Anyways guys, I know this is a short video. Hopefully you're okay with that. But, you know, just means that I have more time to record more videos. It's pretty good, right? No. <laughs> But anyways, guys, hopefully you enjoyed this video. If you did, be sure to smash that fucking like button as hard as you can. Leave a comment and don't forget to subscribe. I will see you guys in the next video. Much love. Bye. Yeah.